couple of weeks ago I ordered this multifunctional flashlight that turned out that it's pretty amazing and it comes in different color you can choose blue with violet or orange with pink blue whatever color you want and from Aliexpress it cost four US dollars but in the description it doesn't says how many milliampers or how much is the capacity of the battery so in today's video I will show you what is inside this multifunctional flashlight and I'm gonna open it let's start today's video for those who see this for the first time let me show you what this multifunctional gadget is on the top we have a compass we have a flashlight Take a look with three modes high low and flashing mode by the way in the same time we have a led indicator with showing how much percentage is the battery right now is 53 percent and when you open this thing press it the lid automatically opens and we have an electric lighter and by the way with each press it counts how many how many times did you turn on the lighter 39 40 41 with some color LEDs on the side and by the way I like this transparent front panel where you can see the electronics they call it dual plasma arc take a look and yes it's pretty cool oh. and the gadget is pretty cool but I noticed that the only bad thing is that the type C connector is on this side or inside you need to open the lid so you can charge it but they claim also that this thing is waterproof so that's why the type C connector is inside nice now let's open it uh, we have one rubber band right here for the lid first I'm gonna take it that okay next is to remove the rubber power button okay next thing is to pull but I need to ah, okay nice and I forgot to mention here we we have small micro switch when it's pressed it activates the lighter and also the electronics and the voltage indicator and I think because of the size I think that inside there is some kind of lithium battery maybe 14450 not 8650 18650 but, but like double A battery 14450 lithium battery we're gonna see that just to unscrew these two side screws one and one on the back Oh, I forgot to turn on the, the badge so you can read that I'm uploading new videos every day let's remove this rubber band also come on all right we have two water waterproof rubber bands I need to be gentle whoa okay and here it is the micro switch that I'm, that I have mentioned the type C connector whoa ah oh. 
I can see it. It's an ordinary package of lithium battery. But take a look how small it is. can see it, I need to clean it. Okay. It says that it's 260 milliampers, 0.962 watt hours, 3.7 volts. Okay. It's pretty small and low capacity battery. And take a look what is this. It's the coil for the dual plasma arc lighter oh, can I put some bigger battery right here maybe I'm gonna find out okay and the flashlight okay 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 we're gonna test the the LED chip, how much current is pulling and how much current is pulling the lighter. I'm gonna desolder the battery and attach some wires and hook up on my power supply. Let's do that. I pull out the battery and instead I solder two wires, positive and neg negative. Here it is my homemade beautiful power supply and I love it. It's set on 4 volts right now. I'm gonna hook up my power supply as power source. Hit on. And the gadget has turned it on and it shows 80% full. And it's set on 4.13 volts. Okay, I'm gonna use this power button to press the, bu the push button. Okay, and at high mode of the LED, it's pulling 600 milliampers. That means that this LED chip is 2.5 watts. One press at low. 130 milliampers, 0 0.5 watts, and strobe. Take a look. Okay, and turning off. And now we're gonna see how much current is pulling the dual plasma lighter. Okay. Whoa. It can work. What does it mean? It means maybe it me it needs more than four amperes. I'm gonna set to five amperes. And no, doesn't work. Wow, it's pulling more than five amperes. Take a look. I'm gonna set to six. What is the problem? Seven amperes. Reset. Why? I can't figure out why it doesn't start. Sometimes it starts, sometimes sometime don't. Take a look. And it's pulling three and it stops. It pulls three amperes. Why? I don't get it. If you know why, please comment below so I can learn. But I'm gonna hook up now the battery and set up my multimeter to amperes and see the real amperes that this thing is pulling while the dual arc plasma is working. Another setup. I put it back the battery and through the multimeter I'm gonna measure the amperes. And let's try that. Hitting the 
micro switch and take a look it's working and it's pulling 2.3 amperes whoa what does it mean that means that using this battery with 260 milliamperes this thing will last how much also you can comment that in the comment section and in my last video review of this gadget uh, many of you comment will it work while charging and we're gonna test that right now by the way it's charging with 230 milliamperes that means that in one hour the battery will be fully charged <coughs> where is oh here it is i'm gonna try to start while charging and take a look what happens it flashes it can be turned turn it on while charging okay and let's try the lighter nope it doesn't work so first you need to charge it then to operate all right I hope you enjoy in today's video tear down of this multifunctional gadget and my conclusion is probably the bigger capacity will be better and there is a room for bigger battery maybe I will replace it okay thank you for watching please give a like share and subscribe to my channel see ya